Well, Sunday is finally here. Um, it's been a different week for sure. Um, going to Orlando, that was totally unexpected. Um, the first few days was pretty hard. Um, you know, the lupus, the pain, and everything. And then by the time I got to where I could enjoy myself, it was time to get back on the plane to fly home. Um, I've been pretty much resting. Last night I got into some really excruciating pain and just having one of my pity parties too. It's just everything, just the all the travel and emotions and everything of the week just caught up with me. So I've been trying to rest today. Um, Josiah did come over and trim up my hair. Finally, my bangs got long enough for me doing the whack job on them to where he could come and actually make them look professional. <laughs> um, I like how when I watch other the videos of the Europeans, they say they call it their fringes instead of bangs. I like the word fringes better, so I think I'll start calling them my fringes. But um, trying to rest up. Church is tonight, and I definitely want to make it to church. So, other than the activity of getting my hair cut, I'm just sitting down or laying down and resting and so I can make it to church. That's my priority and that's where I want to be tonight. Dwayne found his glasses said thank you God because eyeglasses and especially when they're bifocals those are a big expense so he found them we're very happy we are very, very happy. Now for my charm and my earring to show up. Those need to be found. Okay, we made it and I'm heading to church and the weather is beautiful. Um, it says it's actually 66 degrees outside. So, we say Oklahoma gets five good days of weather a year and today is one of them. Um, usually we just get a handful of just really nice cool temperatures and breezes and not winds and all that kind of stuff so tomorrow we'll wake up and it'll be a snowstorm <laughs> that's how it goes in Oklahoma <laughs> church. It was a wonderful, wonderful Sunday service and I just love getting to see my friends and being around church family and it's just a good thing. Um, I'm having really horrible stomach spasms and I've taken my medicine and it's not taking effect yet and I'm sitting here, I'd rather be in fetal position, rolled up, rolling around, but after you go so far, it's just like, what good will that do? So, I'm just bucking up. I'm a big girl, <laughs> and oh, I just wish the pain would go away. And with that, I'm going to show... A video that I made in the middle of the night last night and I believe that's how I'm gonna close out um, I was in severe pain there also and it was getting the best of me but I want to document it and show you know what 
lupus truly is. So, I'll put that video on here. Remember, it was in the middle of last night. I am feeling better today, but with that, with lupus and fibromyalgia and Sjogren's and Raynaud's and everything that comes under the umbrella of lupus. I just want to be speechless. The pain doesn't go away. Okay, here's the reality of lupus that I hate so much. The whole week has finally caught up with me. I'm in, you know, severe pain. And the swelling is it's just so uncomfortable. I've got so much swelling on me everywhere. And my belly is spasming and swollen horribly. is lupus. I had already finished my video for the day and, you know, got it uploaded, but then, you know, my pain just kept, keeps on getting worse and worse, even taking, you know, any breakthrough pain medicines. And then, you know, I'm doing all I can to get the swelling off. You know, we've doubled the Lasix. And then, like, I guess, like the vasculitis in the stomach. It's just, what do you do? I can, of course, I can take more prednisone and it'll take away the pain, but it'll make the swelling worse. And that makes the breathing worse, and I'm just not comfortable. I know I'm going to have to sleep sitting up tonight. I'm ready for a change. You know, ready for a cure. Ready for a miracle. Ready for remission. But I was in bed and I was just going to go ahead and try to sleep and stuff and see how I was in the morning. But I wanted to document, you know, just how people have got to understand what lupus is all about and this is a day in the life of lupus my traveling you know gets the best of me but I'm not gonna give up doing what I love to do I'm not gonna do it oh if only I could breathe I knew it could be so important I'm sure I'm not the only one shedding tears tonight. I'm sure I'm not the only one in unbearable pain. So let's keep on trudging forward. We've won the battle. We just got to make it to the end. And that remission will come. One day I'm going to be able to go out in the sun. I'm going to be able to drive again. I'm going to be able to do whatever I want to do when I want to do it. I'm going to be able to take care of my husband and my son and my household. That day's coming and I'm looking forward to it. No matter how bad this pain gets, it's not going to get the best of me. See you guys in the next video.